watch the show beforehand and pick out John Paul Jones as like that's the guy. For okay, me. number one, never seen Bachelor in Paradise until this season. Uh -huh. um, number two, I did watch Hannah's season. But John Paul Jones, like, he was just a goof to me. Like, I didn't really take him seriously. So, he was a pleasant surprise. Yeah, so was that kind of shocking to you when you found yourself attracted to him? Oh, my, yes. Well, first of all, I was, always loved his hair. So, like, that kind of drew me in yeah. initially. But, yeah, to hit it off with John Paul Jones, like, I don't think anybody saw that coming. So, it was great. So, then the moment we saw you say goodbye to him was, like, heartbreaking. Mm -hmm. What... I mean, how hard was that for you to do? Then, like, saw you chase him, like, down the beach. No. Um, watching him walk away, I think, is what really got me. And I yeah. think that um, I know how genuine and how much of a good guy he is deep down. And um, when you find someone that makes you laugh like that and makes you feel, like, loved and special and cherished, um, you don't really want to give that up. And so I think that was, that's what was going through my mind. But at the same time, I just wasn't there where he was yet. So I was really conflicted, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, it seems like it would be hard to get there in the, like, two weeks of Bachelor in Paradise. I mean, it can happen. Yeah, you've seen it happen before. I mean, we've seen it happen before where people do find long-lasting love. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, it sounds crazy and bizarre and, like, what the hell are you guys doing? But it works. So... <laughs> Um, can you kind of give us any sort of tease about what we might see from you at the reunion, like reuniting the back of the Jungle Jones? Um, the reunion's going to be a good one. Um, as far as John Paul Jones and I, I don't know. You just have to watch. It was difficult to accept that she wanted me to pursue other relationships because uh, I felt very, I felt convicted and you know my own you know desire to be with her and kind of stunk and I knew there a lot of drama would have unfolded as a result and it was just kind of a crappy deal honestly. Um, and then we saw you leave alone. Right. What? I mean, that was an incredibly emotional. Like her running after you on the beach. Like that was kind of a that was kind of a romantic drama moment for you guys. Um, what, how were you feeling at that point? And like. Had you given up on this yeah, um, again, like the breakup just made me question, you know, the authenticity of the whole experience. Um, you know, Tasha hadn't really vocalized how she felt about me, but we had some, you know, amazing moments together. And um, yeah, it was just, it, it just made me question the process.